Yo guys, what is up? It is CJ or Sorbo bringing this video on my channel once again. Now in today's Crunker video, we're going to be going over how much my inventory cost in US dollars. Now you guys might be saying, Cal just did this video and you were right. But fun fact, I actually had this same video idea a very long time ago, but I was just going to go over how much frostbite cost. And at the time I thought it went for about $12,000 and now it goes for about 10 times that. <laughs> And I never made that video because A, I didn't really know how to make it, you know, content filled because it'd only be about frostbite and be like, yeah, frostbite's this much. Thanks for watching. But ever since Cal uploaded his video, I actually know the equation to try to figure out all the prices for these items. So Cal made this video possible. If you guys want to go watch Cal's video about how much his inventory costs, it's literally insane. That man could buy like two Lamborghinis with his Krunker inventory. <laughs> I'll have it on the I card right here in the description. Go check out Cal. He's a really good guy. And I just want to say I did have this video idea before he made his, but he made his before I made mine. So all credit goes to Cal. But I've always wondered how much my Crunker inventory is worth in dollars, and that's what we're going to be going over today. Also at the moment, selling your Crunker items for money is actually also against TOS, which defeats the whole purpose of this whole entire video. But since now Crunker is on Steam, there's a chance Crunker might be added to the Steam market. And the Steam market is pretty much places where you can buy like CSGO items and other games items for real life money. Now it's been rumored that Crunker is going to be on there eventually, but it's not confirmed. So everything that I'm talking about inside of this video is assuming that it does go to the Steam market. But before before we get into the video, according to YouTube's calculations, only 38% of the people who do watch these Crunker videos are subscribed. And as you guys know, we're getting stupidly close to 100,000 subscribers. So to all the people who are watching these Crunker videos and aren't subscribed, please subscribe to make my day. And then finally, if you guys want to go buy some Crunkies to buy some really cool items, make sure you guys use creator code SORBLE. Also, by the time you're watching this video, the new item shop will be out. So make sure you guys use creator code SORBLE. And without further ado, let's see how much my inventory is worth inside of Crunker.io. So the equation we're going to use is based off this package. You buy $100 worth of KR and you get 60,000 KR. And if you do the math on this, you get about 600 KR per every dollar. So pretty much what we want to do for any equation, let's just say the item's worth a million, we're going to do a million divided by 600. So to make this clear, per every 600 KR, it's about a dollar. So once we go into my Crunker inventory, we can immediately see that my estimated value is 3.2 million KR. However, that's just a complete estimate. Frostbite goes for a lot more than that. And then there is also a ton of contrabands which have no estimated value because they cannot be traded or sold. So keep that in mind. Like these two items just right here are worth about what? Like 250, 260,000. So we're going to keep that in mind once we get there. But like Cal's video, I'm going to go from the lowest rarity to the highest rarity and go over how much money each is worth. So let's start at Uncommon. So as you guys can see, my estimated value for Uncommons is 70,866. And that's actually quite impressive seeing how most Uncommons go for literally nothing. Like a lot of them go for 5, 10, 20 KR. So the fact that I have 70,000s worth of KR in greens is insane. I however don't have any very rare Uncommon items. They're all very common even though they're Uncommon. But since all of our Uncommons were 70,866, we're going to divide that by 600 and that gives us $118 and that is literally mind-boggling to me because in theory if I sold all of these greens I would get $118 sign me up that's literally insane and it really just goes to show you how much more insane this is gonna get we're literally only at uncommon we still have rare epic legendary relic contraband and etc speaking about more let's go ahead and move over to rare so jumping up to rare as we can see my estimated value is 135,155 which is about double what my uncommons are worth so if i had to imagine it's going to be about double the dollar amount as well which is about like 236 dollars or so so we're going to take 135,155 and divide it by 600 and surprisingly enough 135,155 care worth of blues is worth 225 dollars and 26 cents so in theory i could sell all of my blues inside of crunker for 225 dollars again sign me up please let me do this <laughs> Obviously, you have to take in consideration. These are all just estimates. And also, you have to think realistically. No one in their right mind is going to buy all of my blues for $225. So just make sure you're keeping that in mind in this video. Don't get any crazy ideas. Because if this ever does become possible, I really highly doubt that you're going to be able to sell all your blues for $100 some dollars. Alrighty, so let's go ahead and move over to Epic. I'm assuming it's just going to keep on going up and up and up. Moving over to Epic, our estimated value is 181,798 that is actually really interesting you would think it'd be a lot higher as the rarities go up but at least here it barely moved it only went up like 40,000 surprisingly enough but to be fair epics aren't super super sought after there's a lot of cool skins don't get me wrong but at the same time it's like the least sought after of the sought afters and then once again our estimate value of 181,798 KR worth of epics divided by 600 comes out to about 303 dollars 
this is starting to add up a lot. So all of those purples that you're getting through your spins that you just do not want could be worth hundreds of dollars. Obviously, like I said, not likely, but in theory, yes. All right, so this is where it's going to start getting a little bit more interesting because we're getting higher and higher in the rarities, which are worth a lot more. So let's go over to Legendary and see how much our estimated value is. And our estimate value is 232,077 KR. Now, I do have a ton and ton and ton of Legendaries. And to be honest, I don't really care about probably 90% of them, but there is a few Legendaries I would really like to keep such as the best sniper in the game. But if we take our estimate value of 232,077 KR worth of legendaries, and obviously divided by 600, we get a total of $386.80. At this rate, I might be able to retire soon. <laughs> now, this is the rarity, in my opinion, which I'd see a lot more items being bought at, but I don't think you could sell all of your items for maybe $400. For example, as we said, 600 KR is about a dollar. Or here, here's a good example. We have the TTV Tron and it's worth about 1200 KR. And it probably honestly trades and sells for less than that. But going off the estimate, if you sold this right now, you would get about $2. Just to put that in perspective for you guys. That being said, things are getting very, very excited. Let's go ahead and move over to Relic. And going ahead and sorted by Relic, as you guys can see, my estimate value is not going up that much, much, much. But our estimate value is 238,622 KR worth of relics. Thought I had a lot more relics, to be honest with you. I feel like I almost have more contrabands than relics, which is kind of weird. I did, however, give away and trade a lot of my relics. So this could be a lot higher, but for now, it is only 238,622. So if we take our estimate of 238,622 KR and divide it by 600, we get $397.70. Very, very close to $400, which is literally insane seeing how much some of the other rarities went for and how much it just keeps on going up and up and up. And this is also another rarity where I'd see a lot more people buy buying items from this because relics are sought after relics look really nice they usually have animations or they're very sought after so this is the rarity where I'd most definitely see people start buying items but it'd probably have to be very specific items I don't think we're gonna see up until contraband where people would actually start paying good money for contrabands and obviously unobtainable so speaking of which this is about to get insane. Let's go ahead and move over to contraband. Now, I'm very interested to see what this number is going to be. And the number, our estimated value worth of contrabands is 1,256,841. Okay, that is actually pretty sick. That's a lot of KR, okay. And that's not even including my frostbite either, wow. So like we said, there is a handful of contrabands that are just not being counted towards KR. And I can't calculate the total amount of KR that I am missing out of my estimated value. Because as you can see, dummy grenade, VSS, overload, Chaffe and stuff like that just cannot be sold or traded. But I know for a fact I paid 110,000 KR for the VSS and 150,000 KR for the dummy grenade. So we're gonna add 260,000 to our estimated value. And keep in mind, we're still missing out on probably a few hundred thousand KR from our non-estimated items. So with the 260,000 added from the dummy grenade and the VSS, we get 1,516,847. So if we take our 1,516,841 KR worth of contrabands and divide it by 600, we get, oh my God. <laughs> We get $2,528. $2,528. That is a lot of money. Sadly, I've probably spent more, more than that on Crunker. But that is a lot of money. And that's not even with every contraband in here because like I said, a lot of them don't have estimate values. That is literally insane. $2,500 for all my contrabands? I don't know if I'd be willing to sell a lot of them to be honest with you. Because I'm most definitely more of a collector than a stonker. That's the difference between me and Cal in our videos. He is all about the stonks and I'm all about collecting items. I really get attached to my items for literally no reason in IO game. So that's why my inventory is not quite as insane as his, but I have a lot of items in here that I really, really like and enjoy. But at this rarity, I can most definitely see tons of people paying a lot of money to buy some of these items. Like the most expensive contraband that I have inside of here that has the estimate value is probably my Rune Lord. So using the same equation, let's see how much Rune Lord by itself is worth. 165,000 divided by 600 comes out to $275. So in theory, I could just sell my Rune Lord for $275, which is honestly pretty good. Good. Now, like I've said a hundred times, I doubt anyone's going to be paying that much money for Crunker items, but you never know, especially with unobtainables and the rarer contrabands and stuff like that. I can most definitely see it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, are you guys ready for this? I don't think you guys are ready for this. We're going to be moving on to unobtainable, which is the rarest rarity inside of Crunker. So, and some of these items go for millions and millions. So let's go ahead and sort and see how many, uh, 1.1 million. Guys, even though this item is still one of the most expensive items in the game, just by its estimate, that is literally just what it's been sold for. And the majority of people who have frostbite don't sell it, they trade it, if that. And this is just the estimate value from the market from when it has been sold, but actually through the stonkers and the people who have a lot of KR and stuff like that, are 
think the general community has came to the point where they've accepted the fact that Frostbite's worth about 60 million KR. Because that's the interesting thing about Frostbite. Only 21 people in the world have it. Thankfully, I'm included in that list. And it's one of the rarest items in the game. So in theory, you could pretty much sell this for as much as you'd like. Because there's probably not going to be another chance to get Frostbite. Now, the way I actually have this Frostbite is Sid gave it to me. Which is kind of crazy. Because I'm going to show you guys how much this Frostbite is worth. And Sid pretty much just gave me that. So let's just say Frostbite is worth 60 million KR. I think the community is in a general understanding of that. And this one's a pretty easy equation. You guys might have already caught on to this. But 60 million KR divided by 600 is an absolutely stupid number. And ladies and gentlemen, that number is $100,000. This item on my screen right here, these pixels, this melee item, this Frostbite, this axe, this item right here, in theory is worth a hundred thousand us dollars that is literally disgusting i actually cannot believe that please someone make me an offer for a hundred thousand dollars this is yours this is yours now i want to go back to the point that i don't think anybody in their right mind realistically would ever spend a hundred thousand dollars on frostbite even its estimate value of a million a hundred thousand seven hundred seventy seven kr comes out to a thousand eight hundred and thirty four dollars maybe somebody would pay that much for frostbite but i even feel like at that point it's a little bit pushing it but you never know if they do bring crunker to the steam market i guess we'll just have to see if anybody does want to buy my frostbite for a hundred thousand sign me up please do it <laughs> let me know in the comments down below if you guys had frostbite would you sell it for a hundred thousand dollars i expect every comment say yes if not you're either already rich or you're a psychopath so now that we've gone over how much all of the items inside of my crunker inventory are worth i want to add each rarity up and see how much total my inventory is actually worth and i don't think i'm ready to see this number okay so obviously my one unobtainable is really carrying the group but there's still a lot of money from contraband to uncommon so we're gonna add all of this up and see how much my inventory is really worth in dollars so after adding everything up it is very clear to me that my one unobtainable really 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 carried the group but our total is $103,958.87 so my whole entire inventory is worth $103,958.87 that is literally insane to me. Now I'm just gonna put this out there. If anybody has $103,958.87, if you guys would like to buy my whole entire Crunker account, I will give you a discount. You can have it. I'll give you the password, that the username, everything. You would have it. Cause that is literally insane. The fact that in theory, once Crunker comes to Steam Market, I could potentially make $103,000, almost $104,000 off of my Crunker account. Now I wanna make this very, very clear. The odds of me actually getting this much money for all of my items inside Crunker are little to none. I don't think Frostbite will ever 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 sell for a hundred thousand dollars because there's truly not enough demand for the item i could see maybe somebody selling it for a thousand or two dollars but that might be the max in my opinion and you have to keep in mind a lot of these estimate values are due to inflation like frostbite when it was first sold was sold for like four hundred thousand kr with so many unobtainables being added to the game and they're just being so much kr somehow frostbite is worth 60 million kr now but if you guys were ever curious how much frostbite is technically worth in us dollars it's worth a hundred thousand dollars at the very beginning of this video i said i thought it was worth twelve thousand dollars which is still an astronomical amount of money if anybody wants to buy frostbite for twelve thousand please hit me up but i hope you guys did enjoy this video like i said this was originally cal's idea he did upload this first so make sure you guys go check out his video the amount of money his inventory is worth is absolutely disgusting go check it out you will not regret it and you will be absolutely mind blown like i was let me know in the comments down below if you guys also did this and let me know how much your inventory is worth now i just want to knock this one home and make this super duper duper clear if you guys have an item inside of crunker that's worth millions of kr don't expect to sell it for a few hundred thousand dollars and like i said by the time you watch this video there should be a brand new limited time item shop out inside of crunker and i'll also have a video up on that if you guys have not seen it already and I think that about does it for today's video. If anybody has $100,000 and would like to buy my whole entire Crunker account, please hit me at my business email. And I hope you guys did enjoy. Thank you guys so much for watching once again. And as always, it's been your boy, CJ or Sorable. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.